Hello, this is Godly from Toleriate Cinematics and today I will be showing you how to um, use sound in After Effects CS5 well you can do this in after, uh, every After Effects but I've um, been having this uh, question for a while right now uh, a lot of people that still don't know how to use sound in After Effects and I have to admit I didn't know that at first too when I started out with After Effects so maybe I can help you out um, so um, people say if they play the video they can't hear any sound to um, to sync on it and stuff like that so I will be giving a short tutorial on here to use your sound and yeah to to render it and stuff like that so go to file import and import your file that you want to use so um, let's go to videos um, let's use an introduction and I will be using my recent um, introduction, so right over here. And I'm going to, or this one, I'm going to import this to After Effects. I'm going to drop this onto this icon, and that will make, make a new comp for it with the same um, time as the, as the actual video. So right over here, we have our video. But as you can see, if we play it, and there is sound on it, but if you play it, you don't hear anything and to fix this is well you don't have to click on the play button but you have to click on this button and then it will render out and if you want to see this um, this frame over here that you rendered out you click on it again and then you will hear sun and if you render further you can do that also if you want to render a little uh, short uh, just a short frame to, to listen to your sound just drag this and to the, the space you want to, to render and just hit the button again and you will see that that frame so um, that's how to use the sound but um, how do you see the sound to sync on it so how to see the beats and it's also a really easy um, thing to, to fix you can do this with the arrows but um, I like to use a shortcut, uh, shortcut LL and it will um, just press two times on the button L and this will uh, give you the, the graph over here uh, from the sound so over here it will be pretty loud and over here it will be quiet and again over here you can sync on something and as you can see so you can also zoom in over here and make maybe a marker you can add markers if you want to so um, that's all up to you um, so that's how to do this um, to render the video with the sound just go to composition pre-render and you can click over here and you can choose your, your settings so I'm gonna use a quick time um, quick time okay and video output will be a format from best quality H and uh, 264 uh, I like to use that it's a really good encoder and be sure to enable audio uh, output and well, let's use a stereo if you want to uh, to switch a little, uh, have a, a good surround. And over here you can choose your uh, settings over here. So mostly I take this one or 40 and 48. So um, yeah, just hit OK and then just render out where you want to. So right over here, then hit save and just hit render. I won't do this right now because I don't need a file. I'm nothing with it. So will be just a waste of time uh, it will be working on your side so if you have any more questions and um, just post uh, post it in the comments and I will be um, well I will try to answer all of the, uh, all of the uh, questions so thanks for watching be sure to check out my channel I have a lot of other tutorials for uh, all kinds of software be sure to subscribe and check out my channel and my website uh, I have my portfolio on there so if you want to see what I'm doing just go on my website, you will see everything. Uh, links will all be in the description. Uh, so yeah, thanks for watching and take care.